Hi, in this short video, I'm gonna share with you what Clarity is and how you and your team can use Clarity to help your business owner clients improve and grow their business. Now, the first thing to mention is, yes, Clarity is an online platform that makes it very visual for the client to be able to see how they can do that, but also, Clarity includes a toolkit of systems, of resources, of processes to help your team step by step deliver these services and help package and price them as well. So the first thing to do is to show you what Clarity actually looks like. So when you log into Clarity and sort of your client, you'll see this screen. Now the premise here is very simple. Our mantra is making business simple. And what we're doing here is effectively simplifying strategic gap analysis. All that means really is Where's the business now? Where could the business possibly get to? What's the gap? And then how do we close that gap? And that's what we're doing here for the client in a very visual way. And you'll see in a moment how the client would also be able to collaborate with you to be able to actually get to that ideal uh, vision of the future. Now this first screen is a stick in the sand effectively. Yes, it looks like a dashboard. It very much isn't a dashboard. It's just a stick in the sand to say, this is where the business is now. And we can change these dates to when the figures were last finalized because the live data comes in from zero on QuickBooks Online. You can obviously enter the data manually too if you want to and don't use those platforms. But the idea is now we can see exactly where the client is and what that starting point is. Now, when we go to the future screen, we can then play with the numbers to see what's possible and what type of improvements the client's going to get for their business. Now, before we do that though, what your team will probably like to do is to make your client aware of what potentially they're leaving on the table. So your team can move the slider by 5% for all of them and then send them an email to say, uh, or even a phone call to say to the client that they're leaving profit and cash on the table of these amounts. Now, once the meeting's set up, what you can then do is go through this, each of these lines individually with the client so you can talk to them about how they're going through it, what, uh, what's possible, the how will come in a moment, what's possible to improve their business um, in terms of revenue growth. So maybe they'll say 15% based on what happened the previous year. And you would go through each of these, moving each of these numbers in turn based on what the conversation is you've had with the client. It's a very collaborative approach. Uh, so that you can then help them. And then once you get to the top, you can see exactly what's happened. It's more than we anticipated, which is fantastic. And at this point, the client's chomping at the bit to understand how they can actually do that. So we've done where they are now. We've done where it's, what's possible to get to by making small improvements in lots of different areas. Now we're gonna look at the how. And then what, so how we get to there is we save that particular number. I'm gonna replace the existing action plan that I've got and create the action plan. Now from here, you can see this is where the client's aiming to get to, but this is also a fantastic positioning point because it shows the value that your firm can deliver by working with you, by the client working with you. And also when it comes to discussing the price, it also helps show what return on investment the client is going to get by working with you. So it's a fantastic uh, number to frame the value and the return on investment on the price for your services. Now each area here is just a reminder of what's the at stake for the client and also a reminder of where they are now, where in the current line, where they would like to get to in the target. And then in each area, there, there's prompts for your team to ask questions to the client if they're not forthcoming with what tasks they're going to do to get that extra 15% in this example. And you can create tasks, you can edit tasks and delete tasks and download this as a PDF and email that to the client. You can also invite the client in here and work collaboratively with them too if you want to. The most important thing though here is to work with the client on a who, what, when, so that they know exactly what needs to be done and when, and so do you and your team, so you can hold the clients accountable. That's the secret source in helping them improve and grow their business. Now, there are also other areas within the platform that we call documents. Effectively, this is an online data room. Um, which is great for growing businesses that want investment, want to borrow money or want to exit. And it's built around a strategic plan framework. Uh, so you have access to that within Clarity as well. And we also have the business university. That's for your team and for your clients to learn about different things about business to help them grow and improve on their own. 
They can do things without asking you and also the advisor university. And that's all of the content, all of the how to's and resources and, and guides and processes that we've created, which aren't yet in the platform, but will be very soon. So that is a very short overview of Clarity and how you can use Clarity to help your clients improve and grow their business. And more importantly, get all of your team involved so you can help all of your clients.